There is some absolute heat in 2023, wow. We're gonna be going through all the hype shoes that are releasing this year in 2023. And trust me, it doesn't let you down. Before we do get into it guys, 80% of viewers are not subscribed to the channel. That ratio is horrible, so please can we subscribe to the channel guys? Our goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year. Thank you and let's get into it. Not all of this information will be exact just because it's so far away. Sometimes we're going off rumours and sometimes the retail may be a little off. Starting on the 9th of January, we do have the Jordan 1 Mid Pink Lavenders retailing for £70. This is the GS, which means it's the older kid sizes. You can definitely expect sizes 4.5 to 6 to have some brick flip money and some profit to be made. Also on the 9th, we do have a restock of the Dunk Low Grey Fox. This is a very, very profitable sneaker. You can definitely expect at least £50 profit on this sneaker. On the 11th of January, we do have the Jordan 1 Mid Red Pandas. These will be retailing for £115, and you can't really expect much money to be made, only personal. On the 14th, we do have the Jordan 1 the high true blues now this is a very very cool colorway and this retails for 165 pounds i can definitely expect some brick foot money but mainly personal guys on the 15th we do have the dunk close sesame releasing again i don't expect big money to be made definitely some brick foot money to be made quite a cool looking sneaker and rounding off january we do have the jordan one low unions these should be retailing for around the 125 pound mark and again i can expect some brick foot money but nothing massive as it's a jordan one low let's move on to february we have some heat in february on the 11th of february we do have the jordan Four photon dust and this is a fire looking colorway these will be retailing for 180 pounds and i can definitely expect good money to be made similar to the jordan 4 infrareds mainly because the resale price was around the 220 to 230 pound mark which i can expect this to go up in the future on the 15th we do have the jordan 185 black and white these will be retailing for around the 180 pound mark and you can definitely expect some nice money to be made on the sneaker this is the jordan 185 model so look at the neutral grays for comparison on the 25th we do have the jordan 1 white cement this is an odd looking colorway However, I can definitely expect some profit to be made. Maybe not much. Again, mainly personal. And these will be retailing for £160. Also rumoured but not confirmed to release in February is the Jordan 4 Oil Greens. Now, so far what we've got is it should be releasing on the 9th or the 24th of February. However, with this being a Jordan 4, with this being clean, I can definitely expect some nice money to be made on this sneaker. Kickstarting March and March the 2nd, we do have two colourways of the Amaminier Jordan 12s. This is a black colourway and a white colourway that should be retailing for around £200 mark. Quick foot money there to be made. On the 4th of March, we do have the Jordan 5 UNCs. Probably not any money to be made in the UK. However, I thought I'd mention it because it's a clean looking colorway. One of the releases of the year. On the 11th, we do have the Jordan 3 White Cements Reimagined. These were retailing for £190 and you can definitely expect very nice money to be made in the sneaker with this being a reimagined. Just like we've had the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds, this is very similar but for the White Cement Jordan 3s. And it's also a super clean looking colorway. On the 18th, we do have the Jordan 1 Skyline retailing for £160. Again, most Jordan 1s have been butchered so much this year so brick flip money at best and one of the releases of the year again all the way in march do you have the jordan one travis scott olives due to release on the 25th of march for a retail of 140 pounds now again travis scott jordan one low you to expect fire money on this sneaker so go all out now we do also have a rumor that's supposed to be releasing sometime in 2023 and this is the jordan one black toe reimagined for those of you who don't know the jordan one black toe is an og colorway it will be massive if it ever does restock so if it does restock in sometime 2023 go all out on this release now moving on to april on the april 15th we do have the jordan one high lucky greens a very nice looking colorway retailing for 140 pounds maybe a a little bit more than Brickflip money to be made in the sneaker. It's quite cool looking. On the 22nd for £160, we do have the Jordan 1 Washed Pink. Again, not nice to colorways. Brickflip money at best, with the retail being £160 as well. On the 29th, we do have the Jordan 3 Wizards, retailing for £190. Not much to say about the sneaker. Brickflip money at best. Now, moving on to May. Before we do get on to May, if you want to learn how to sneak resale and all the information about these sneakers that are releasing, I run a group called Kai Kicks Apprentice where we teach everyone about sneaker reselling. Whether you're a beginner, you want to know the basics, such as all the release or the support you need, where to get them, how to get them, where to sell them. Whether you're advanced and you want to start to get into botting, you want to start scaling your business, you want Nike exact stock numbers, you want blazing fast monitors for all the restocks, we have it all covered within Kai Kicks Apprentice. So if you have any interest in sneaker reselling, I definitely suggest joining. Whether you're just trying to secure your personal, or whether you're trying to take this as a business and take it a lot more serious, we cover it all. We have over 200 paid members with loads of different success, which I'll pop up on screen. And if you do want to join, it will be top link down in the description below. And we will drop a 30% off the first month if you use code 2023 to celebrate the new year. Let's get back to the video. Now moving on to May, on May 13th, we do have the Jordan 4 Yellow Thunders retailing for £180. Again, a fire, fire shoe that will be very nice money, so keep your eye on that one. On the 20th of May, retailing for £180, we do have the Jordan 1 Spider-Verse, a very funky looking colorway, definitely some brick fit money 
to be made there. And on the 27th, retailing for £160, we do have the Jordan 1 Vibrations. Again, personal, not much money to be made. Now, anything past this time, they tend to not release yet. So I'm only going off what the rumours we have at the moment. They don't tend to release the sneakers past this month, so we will find out more with time. However, this is what I've got so far for the future months. In June, we have the Jordan 3 Hide and Seek, a very clean looking colorway. These will be retailing for £130, and these are the GS sizes. In July, we do have the Jordan 1 University Blues releasing. This is on the 8th, and it will be retailing for £160, and you can definitely expect more money than usual for this Jordan 1, because it is a University Blue colorway. On the 26th, we do have the Jordan 1 Low UNC to Chicago, and if you don't know, they did release a higher version of this and it didn't really perform the best. However, I can definitely expect some brick foot money on this sneaker, retailing for £120. 28th, retailing for £120, another Jordan 1 Low, and this is the Jordan 1 Low Black Toes. Again, probably some brick foot money to be made there. And in August, on the 12th, retailing for £180, we have the Jordan 4 Red Cements. Again, a very fire looking sneaker. I can definitely expect some profit to be made on this shoe. Now, unfortunately, that's all that's been released and rumoured so far. However, you can definitely expect a lot more throughout the year. Again, guys, if you have enjoyed this video, Video, please do subscribe to the channel because we are trying to get to 10,000 by the end of the year. If you have any interest in sneaker selling and you want to start your own business, then definitely top link down in the description to start your reselling journey. Apart from that, follow me up on all the socials, Instagram, KaiKicks.uk and the group's Instagram, KaiKicks Apprentice, because we like to do some giveaways on there. Good luck in all your releases. Have a great 2023. I hope you all had a great new year and had a good Christmas. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.